Good morning, fellas. It's me, Bindoj, and today I'm gonna showcase a very powerful guard quarter build. So first thing I'm gonna show is the stance. Oh wait, uh, hold up. <laughs> the second thing I wanna show is my talents. So I have heavy hitter. Of course, you need it as a great sword. Conclusion. Um, I don't, I don't even know why would you need it, but I do have bulldozer. I mean, it's not required for this build, but I would say it's better to have it. I also got exoskeleton. It is a must-have, of course. Punishing blow. Of course, it's a pretty good heavy weapon. Talent, so it's better to have it. Media impact. You need this, of course. Phoenix impact is for my, is for my rising flame. So I can get some help while doing the slam thingy. I also have flame rebound, the final arc, and also the fine the really important one. You need Azur Flame. Are this spark for the um the Emperor Flame to prop easier in immolation? It's really good when you are on fire. And also have Prowmania, I, I guess what it's called. Barrage clone. Yeah. And also Emperor Flame. Of course you need it. And finally, for the mantras. So basically, I just put all, most of my mantra on Bloodless, like Arc Beam. Of course, you need to put Bloodless on your Arc Beam because Arc Beam does a lot of damage and it's a ranged one. I mean, a ranged mantra. So that's all. Arc Wave on Bloodless. This one is really good for boss raiding. If you use this move, you're gonna get Bloodless on to onto all of them. So that means you're gonna get to like. At least a bar for flame assault. I put a blue gem and one perfect lens, and I don't, I don't know why I put the perfect lens on it. But I basically just put free glassstone, two magnifying, magnifying stone on it. So the arc suit is really, is really important. So this is a trick in arc suit that most people do not know, but I think some of them knows that. So when you act, oh man, ready? Alright, I'm gonna test it on you, bro. Alright, so when I dodge an attack, I can immediately use an M1. Which means, like this. Yeah. Oh, don't die. Ah! Wait, hold on. Hold on, he's kinda, he's kinda just... Piecing me up. No, break my, break my arc suit. Ah, go away. Hold on. Testing stuff. I don't want it, I don't, I don't really want to kill it, you know? So basically, when you dodge his attack, and what? Yeah, so that's basically it. So now you probably think I will show all the build stuff for this build. Well, if you think that way, you're wrong. Because I only show y'all half of this build. So which means, what makes this build special is that I have three different types of weapons. Such as damage, mix up, and combo. Each weapon have their own play style, which is what I'm gonna show you in Trauma Conflict. So, enough talking, and I hope you enjoy the fight.